Okay, you guys. Uh, I'm today. I'm going to tell you how to uh, get to icons like this on your folders and stuff like that. So first of all, let's just uh, okay. We're gonna go to the link in the description. So you're gonna get Icon Packager, which is gonna be a program. You gotta put this in. You gotta download it. It's very easy. It'll have a RAR file, so it's gonna look like gonna look like this so just export it to your desktop extract it okay, you're gonna get this so first of all you're gonna run up run the setup okay candle I already have it so as soon as you uh, finish it then uh, just okay as soon as you finish installing this um, You'll get Icon Packager on your desktop. So, what you're gonna do now is you're gonna click on here, and you're gonna click on Icon Packager for patch. You're gonna double click it. Allow. It's gonna give you this crap. This. Yeah. Okay. So, what you're gonna do is you're gonna click Patch. So let's run through it quickly. You're gonna look for icon packager, so it's right here. You're gonna patch it, okay? That's what you're gonna do. You're gonna look for it on your desktop, and you're gonna click on icon packager, and you're gonna patch it, okay? All right. Now you're gonna download the other link in the description, which is Ivis Reflective Icons. These are the icons you're going to patch. I mean, uh, package. So let's double click this. And here you got some stuff like this will be my next video showing you how to change the mouse. Okay, so here you have all your icons, which look pretty cool. Like the Mac. Okay, so right now you're gonna Just run this. This is Reflective Icon. This is Icon Packager, actually. I have a Reflective Icon. This is Icon Packager. So, now you're going to go to Add an Icon Package from Disk. And you're going to click on your I have Reflective Icons. I think. I'm pretty sure that's what you do. And yeah, that's exactly what you have to do. Then you're going, you're going to see this, and you're going to click Apply. And it's going to take a little bit, and then you're going to apply your settings. And then you're done. You're going to get folders like this. They're going to look like this and stuff. So uh, if you haven't done this already, I think what you should do this. You should uh, hide the stuff on your desktop. So it looks like a Mac. Okay. Um... And now that this video is so short, let's just continue. I'm going to show you how to change your mouse. So you're going to go to Control Panel. And then you're going to go to Classic View, if you're not there already. Mouse. And Pointers. And then you're going to, you're going to get the standard Windows Vista ones, and you're going to change them all. So you're going to do Search. Uh, and you're going to go to wherever your fold was, so mine was in iVista Reflective Icons. It comes with it, which is pretty cool. So, and there they are. That's what you have to do. And then you just apply them each. Blah, 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 then you click OK. And you're done. Now you have a complete Mac. Uh, I'll show you how to change your boot menu in the next movie. So, yeah, stay tuned.